Could you just do a web page and website search for me of all 12 signs of the zodiac? Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. I am not a cancer, even though my birth date is July 31st. Mm -hmm. I think you actually have to believe it, um, that this has some significance for it to work. Yeah, it's kind of like a religion, right? But I have no faith in it because it makes absolutely no sense to me. <laughs> Philosophy does. Yes, theology does. <laughs> But the zodiac signs and the horoscopes, yeah. Just let's go through all of those that are big horoscope believers that thought, well, I'm going to sew in and everything's going to be true. Yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, uh, search for Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer. I know for those that have cancer, you're like, you're going to find cancer centers of, of the United States or something. <laughs> That's not necessarily a negative. Why don't you get me all of those that... When you find that they have cancer, yes. Why don't you ask them what their faith does for them? You know, it's not necessarily a negative to find out who it is that has cancer. I'd like to know uh, what the smell of death does to those that are decaying because of the effects of cancer or chemotherapy. Yes. My grandmother had chemotherapy. I've, I've known a few people that have had chemotherapy. And when you're a non-existent being known as a dog that looks like an actual oath of office, what does chemotherapy and cancer treatments do to you? <laughs> now, let's say you didn't like the blinding light. You're like, no, I'm not looking at the sun. <laughs> Why don't we take some perfectly healthy lookalikes of citizens, attorneys, and, well, uh, civil rights coordinators? Yes. Those that are teachers in the Brennan and, and Quilcene School District. Yeah. Let's give them some chemotherapy to see what exactly it does. Now, when you experiment on those in the family, yes. I would like to know the effects of chemotherapy on those that don't have cancer. Yes. Yes. See, usually you only use medical therapies... Uh, because of what has been diagnosed as an illness or disease. But what if we used the cancer therapies for those that don't have cancer on those mm -hmm, that don't have cancer? Yes. To see what exactly would be the effect. Mm -hmm. See, I don't like it when it's this way, that way. Pouch. So why don't we just uh, prescribe some... Well, fake, yes, diagnosis of cancer. Ooch, ooch, ooch. And then let's give them some real, ooch, uh, cancer treatment. <laughs> you know what, dog? I really don't like you. Well, let's use some real cancer treatments on some fake patients that don't have now, I'm going to want my sons, and as much as you say it's torturing those in the family that want to destroy the religions of the world, I say it's research, yes, to find out the effect of cancer treatments on those that don't have cancer. 